Hey everyone, welcome to Barbell Sanctuary. I'm Steph, and in this video, we're gonna talk about how to lose all that excess fat that you gain during quarantine, and how to get ready for summer in six weeks. Let's get into it. Okay, hey everyone. We've been in quarantine now for a couple months. Whether you're working or not working, it doesn't matter. Everybody's stress level has been high. So even if your routine was somewhat the same, it's really not the same. Because for those that were working, your jobs were a lot more stressful. You were a lot busier, I'm sure, because of reduced staff. The stress level being higher makes it harder to stick to your diet. It makes it harder to eat healthy. You're always on the go, 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 go. If you're on the opposite end of the spectrum and you just had to quarantine at home, that is also stressful. You have more access to, to food and snacks, boredom. It's just not a good situation that we've all had to live through. Now, summer is coming. I know not every state, not every province, not everywhere in the world is getting better. It's starting to, to flatten the curve. I know in my uh, home province of New Brunswick, we're actually doing really well. Businesses are going to be opening tomorrow now with restrictions and hopefully everybody's safe and wears a mask while they go out so it can keep the same. We'll be allowed out of the house. People will be going back to work. Lives are gonna be not like they were before, but it's gonna get a bit better. Summer, right now we are the 10th of May. So in approximately six weeks, it's gonna be really nice out. You're gonna be outside, maybe going to the beach, you know, starting to hit the pools with your shirt off. You wanna look good. You wanna lose that extra weight that you've put on in the last couple months. I know that I do. I've stayed fairly uh, consistent, but I'm definitely not where I was planning on being at this point this close to summer. So I'm gonna talk about the strategies that I'm gonna to use to get myself ready for the next six weeks. This video is gonna be short and to the point. There's a lot more information on all that I'm gonna talk about out there and I'll even put some links in the video at the end. First things first, calorie deficit. Easiest way, take your body weight, times it by 12, and that's the calories that for 90% of the people that'll put you in a calorie deficit if you're active. Just take your body weight times 12 and try to hit those calorie goals. Now, having said that, your macros are also important, but the most important one is gonna be protein because you're trying to lose weight. You wanna keep all your muscle definition. So one gram of protein per body weight. Try to hit that every day and that's it for calories. The next thing you're gonna to wanna to do, you're gonna to wanna to train because you can lose weight, but if you're not training, you're gonna lose muscle and fat. You wanna do strength training minimum three times a week Personally, I'm gonna be doing four times a week, but a good balance is three strength training sessions a week and three cardio sessions. Cardio can be an hour of walking. That's all I'm doing is just walk, incline walking on the treadmill three times a week for an hour, burns those extra calories, and it uh, doesn't impede your body's ability to recover from the strength training. And basically that's it, that's gonna be my strategy. Now, the most important part though, consistency and adherence. It's all good to say that you're going to do these things, but if you don't do them, six weeks flies by and you're done. I have a calendar and I'm going to mark my six weeks with a countdown. And every day that I hit my calories, I'm going to put a green check mark. If I don't hit them, I'm going to put a red X. My goal is to have 80% adherence. If I can hit that 80%, guaranteed I will, I will be where I need to be in six weeks. So what are my personal goals? My personal goal, I'll say it right here, so I have accountability. I want to be under 180 pounds. Right now, I'm hovering between 185, 189, fluctuates wildly, but as I've said, explained in other videos, I usually take my seven day average is 187 right now. So I want to be under 180 pounds. That's only seven pounds in six weeks. I can do that quite easily if I stick to my program. To help with the consistency, every time I feel like going over on my calories, cheating on my diet, I'm gonna visualize what I think I'm gonna look like under 180 pounds. I'm gonna visualize where I'm gonna be and that it helps you to stay consistent. You have to think about it every day. You have to think about it all the time. What I wanna do, I have, I have visible abs. I'm starting to see the line separate the last two. I really want more definition, lose a little bit of this. And I think by losing that eight to nine pounds, will get me there. All right, so I've talked about strategies of how I'm gonna stick to my goals and how I'm gonna get to where I need to be. My 
Final strategy is that I, uh, I hired a coach, Brian Chen from The Body Equation. And just having to report to somebody else, it's, it's actually really been helping me. And I also have clients that I'm coaching and that's something that they say that helps them as well. Because when you're accountable to more than just yourself, you'll think twice before cheating on your diet or skipping a workout because you don't feel like telling your coach, hey, yeah, I didn't work out today. For me, that's something that's really helping me stick to my goals is having that coach to be accountable to. So a short video today, just something to, you know, summer's coming, get ready. If you like the video, smash that like button. If you like this type of content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We'll see you guys next time. Remember, summer, six weeks. Get on it.